there before we can run off into the sunset and have some fun. We got to get through today. Let's check in with meteorologist Lewis Turner here. Hey. So Lewis George, yeah. tell us all about Lewis. the weather. <laughs> Using your your full name. Are you nervous? <laughs> that's a nervous laugh. <laughs> that's a that's a. Oh, I just heard my mom's voice. Uh, <laughs> the, the, the George bringing the middle name in. Uh, no, actually, Mama calls me. That's that's just that's just normal. That's that's what my mama calls me. Lou is for uh, my work folks, and then LT is for the friends. So if you see me out and about, uh, here is a look at uh, the satellite and radar picture right now, and and you're seeing a big meso low situated over a front that's just been draped over us. And for now, you notice that spin uh, bringing the showers over uh, parts of Brunswick, but really just some light to moderate rain on 95. And that's really the only spot where we're seeing those showers right now. So let's go out to the beach. I'm looking at the pier, uh, those showers well offshore. You see a few thick clouds in the dark still waiting on first light. Right now it is 79 though outside with uh, no rain. Winds are calm in fact, so if you needed to get out, take the dog for a walk real quick. Good to go uh, right now. Now we were talking about the afternoon, right? So my weather impact alert is really highlighting the last third of our day today. So while uh, temps max out in the mid 80s, that heat, that humidity will open up our window for showers and even some thunder by about three o'clock going through that evening commute. Our morning commute, I think as far as weather is concerned, at least will be fine. Uh, but it's that evening commute. I'm kind of concerned we could see some heavy downpours over at I-95 again. Now by high school football time, when we're kicking off at seven o'clock, we're going to talk about that in the forecast. We're going to show you some computer modeling coming up here in just a moment. But let's look now at those roads. Katie Jeffries is standing by looking at what we can see on the real time 